if the top load washing machine is draining water on any wash mode. I will tell you how to fix this problem in this video. When we see the back side of the washing machine, the water flow switch is installed at the back, which senses how high the water level is in the drum. Due to this water level sensor, the drain pump turns on and off. So let me tell you about the mechanical fault that caused the drain pump to operate in any mode in which you run the machine and if we move towards the downward part of the machine. An air trap system is installed in the machine. This complete starting from here till here is an air trap system. If too many scales are made inside it or if it gets choked, then this happens if the washing machine has taken water once, the air traps inside the pipe of the water flow switch. That air will not be able to go out because the air has to go out through this air trap. And if the air is not able to go out of the air trap, the drain pump will continuously work. And you will think the electronic system of the washing machine is faulty. The other mechanical fault is that if this water flow switch gets stuck inside. For that, you will have to watch the video on the water level switch working, which I have already made and will be linked at the end. A ferrite core is installed inside this water flow switch. If the ferrite core gets stuck from the top side of the water flow switch, this means that it is giving the circuit board these signals that the drum of the washing machine is filled with the maximum level of water. So turn on the washing machine's drain pump to drain the water. And thus, this is also the reason that the drain pump will keep working. Now, I will tell you how to fix and find these mechanical faults. So for that, these procedures will be adopted. If the air is already trapped in the pipes, remove the clip of the pipe where it is attached. Then, remove the pipe from the air trap. I am using a screwdriver to do it. The pipe has loosened up. As you will detach the pipe from the air trap, all the air from the flow switch will go out, and thus, the water flow switch will be freed. This is how you will test the washing machine. After removing this pipe, you test the washing machine, and it started to work normally. Then this means that molds have blocked the air trap of the washing machine. The air trap will need to be cleaned. For that, you will have to open the whole drum of the washing machine, and clean it. But now, after removing the pipe, if your washing machine is still having the same problem, then, you will have to test the electronics and the electrical part of the washing machine. When the water level switch works in normal conditions, its working frequency is high. But as its ferrite core gets stuck, the frequency decreases. Then, you will have to study that water level switch accordingly because every company sets the frequency of the water level switch according to their calculations. After that, you will have to test the electronics part of the washing machine. Click on the left video to learn how the drain system works with the circuit board installed in it. And subscribe. Thank you.